Are you trying to calculate the current yield of a bond, but you're not sure how to do it? Well, you've come to the right place because I'm Professor Capco, and I'm going to make it super easy for you today. But first, I want to say I believe something great is going to happen for you today. And now, back to the video. I would really appreciate it if you give this video a thumbs up. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm and also trying to reach 4,000 watch hours. So anything you can do, uh, any of my videos you can watch, pass it along, share, I would appreciate it. Thank you. And let me show you real quick today how to calculate the current yield of a bond that has a coupon rate of 6.5% and is priced at $1,040. All right, so these bonds trade. Bonds are evidence of debt. If you're not familiar with bonds, I've got a link up here that I post that is an introduction to bonds. And today we're trying to figure out what the current yield is of a particular bond that's listed here. Current yield would be what is the interest rate that you are earning if you bought this bond today at $1,040. That's the price it's trading at. Because it's in this range, we're gonna presume that it's par or face value is $1,000. That's a reasonable assumption. Usually it's in a round number like that, 100, 1,000, 10,000, something along those lines. And since this is trading at $1,040, a reasonable assumption if you get a problem like this would be that the par value or face value is $1,000. In other words, this bond at its when it matures, it will pay you $1,000 cash back. Uh, but in the meantime, it's going to be paying 6.5% interest. We want to find out what the real interest rate is, the current yield, if we have to pay more than the par value, in this case, $1,040. Let's think about this logically for a moment. If we're paying more than par value, do we expect that the interest rate that it's yielding would be lower or higher than the coupon rate, which is the stated rate. Put it down in the comments if you know. The actual real rate is going to be lower than this. And we know this because if we just bought it for $1,000, we'd be getting 6.5%. But if we have to pay more than $1,000, that means the interest we're receiving is less than the coupon rate. Bonds trade opposite of the, or inversely to the interest rates. So if the interest rates go down, the bond price goes up. If the interest rates go up, the bond price goes down. Let's look at the formula for this. The formula is current yield is equal to the annual interest amount over the current market value. So the first thing we need to figure out is what the annual interest amount is. I'm going to pull out my BA2 plus calculator uh, just to show you how we do this. Some of this you could just do in your head, but I'm going to do it on the calculator just to be on the safe side. If you'd like one of these for yourself, I'm going to put a link down in the description where you can pick one up. All right, we have a face value. So we always find out the, the interest rate, the current annual interest by multiplying the face value, not the price that we're paying, but the actual par or face value times the coupon rate. So face value times coupon rate will give us the annual interest amount. So our face value is $1,000. We're going to multiply it by 6.5%. So I can enter that as 6.5 and hit the percent button here and equal and that gives us $65. So every year we're gonna get $65 from holding this bond. What is the current market value? The current market value is given right here, the $1,040. We're gonna divide the, the 65 by the 1,040. So I can, I've got the 65 already in there, so I can just hit divide and 1040 equals 0. 0.0625. So if we have 0 0.0625 is our decimal, if I'm going to change that to a a percent, if you've got forgot how to do that, I've got a video linked up here and you can take a look at that. We're going to move the decimal place 
over two places, one, two. So the interest rate is 6.25%, which is less than the 6.5%, which is what we predicted. We just didn't know the amount. It's in the direction we permit we predicted, and we can pretty be pretty confident that we got that right. So if you buy that bond today at that $1,040, you're earning 6.25% when you receive those checks for $65. That's all I have for you today. If you like this kind of content, subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. Thank you.